Well, there was more action today in the case of the former Santa Cruz County Treasurer accused of taking more than $39 million in county money. Now, as KGO 9's Craig Smith reports, a key player in the effort to get the money back had a, a look at Elizabeth Gutfar's real estate. A court-appointed receiver came out to look at the properties he controls now under court order. It's the receiver's job to be sure no one sells or hides anything that could have been bought with county money. A sheriff's deputy and an investigator from the Santa Cruz County attorney were there during the inspection, but Santa Cruz County says they were there to maintain order, not to do any sort of criminal investigation. As of now, Gutfar is not facing any criminal charges. This is video from an earlier hearing on the civil lawsuit. Gutfar's attorney, Jonathan and Safer says she was at the ranch voluntarily during the inspection and cooperated with the process. In a related development, Santa Cruz County has been fighting with the Arizona Auditor General over who dropped the ball and allegedly let millions of dollars be embezzled before anyone noticed. The Auditor General claims Santa Cruz County failed to see red flags in the treasurer's reports. Santa Cruz County is threatening to sue the auditor, claiming it's the auditor's job to be the watchdog and it was napping through 10 years years of embezzlement. Craig Smith, KGON 9.